guys, me Sammy here with another unboxing review, and as you can tell by the title of the video, and with the part three Lane McQueen Mattel, I am being here. Well, this isn't really Mattel, but it's from Cars 3. It's this! A Disney Store Cars 3 die cast toys that I got today. In my local mall. In the Disney Store. Sorry. So this box includes Sterling, a rookie racer, Lightning McQueen, Cruz Ramirez, and another rookie racer. So technically, I don't have like any other um, Cars 3 Mattel or any Cars 3 diecast except for this. And now I have this. So the only thing I'm going to be comparing these two is just with Lightning McQueen with um, the Mattel version, and, um, the first Cars movie, Lightning McQueen, Disney Store. I don't have a Disney Store Cars 2 World Grand Prix Lightning McQueen, but my pop-up did order a Cars 2 Disney Store Lightning McQueen off eBay, so it should come in a few days. Oh yeah, by the way, I was making a fire flush. So, I'm gonna unbox this. Oh, that's embarrassing. Okay, so I got these guys out of the box, so now to, um, you know, twist these. RC Cars 5 literally, um, well, yesterday, did a review of this, the same pack, yesterday, and now I'm doing it. So I got the tape off, so I'm just gonna twist this. But since I'm holding my phone with one hand and I'm going to be doing this with one hand, I'm just going to cut this off and then I'll be back when I got all these guys out. So I got all of these it's out of here. There's really ones that are still left. Some of them I kind of just ripped them off. Don't worry, they, got, they don't got no scratches. By the way, this also says, Welcome to the Rusty Strength Center. And the rest of the trash is in there. So... Let's get on to the characters. So, I want to start with my favorite, Lightning McQueen. So, I'll be comparing this Lightning McQueen to both the Mattel and the first Cars version of the Lightning McQueen. But I don't have, like, you know, as I said before, World of Grand Prix one, so deal with it. So, as you can see, um, real quick with my first version one, it's pretty beat up, but it's like eight years old or something no not eight years old probably about like um six years old or something so that's why it's really damaged but you see it in my other videos so i think first i'm going to compare it to um the mattel one so as you can see they have different faces i like this one better they're both red just with different red shading sort of like darker Here's the base real quick. So this one's metal. And this one's plastic. Of course, your wheels both say light ear. Here's the spoiler on the back. Rusty's Medicaid and butt mill ointment, 95. There's that. So yeah, not that much different. Oh yeah, by the way, they do also have like another Cars 3 Disney Store by the McQueen. It's the one where he's gonna have it throughout half of the movie as well, where he has like Rusty's and like big letters on the hood and across the sides and spoiler and you can probably find that at the Disney store at least in trailers oh yeah by the way um before I compare these two um Cruz Ramirez license license plate right there is a little teared up right there so yeah all right 
course, different expression. These are real headlights. These are stickers. So, of course, a Red Sea sponsor is a little bit bigger and brighter. Of course, on this one, he has the lightning ball and call. I mean, I was about to say calls. In Cars 1, and then in Cars 3, he keeps the flames from Cars 2, just a little extended. And he also has less sponsors, like on here he has more. Here, he has a little less, he has about four. Here's the back. Um, he has real headlights and not stickers. Rusty's mannequin bump ointment. And he doesn't have that yellow stripe anymore because he's not a rookie ever since Cars 2 came. But these guys are rookies because they're called Rookie Racers. Look, it says it right there. Rookie Racer. Bam. Okay. And here's the base compared to it. So this is more of a shinier metal and it's also... Um, gray while this one's black it kind of feels like this kind of metal right here so yeah and i would probably prefer this one over this and but over mattel i like this one more than that so that's nice so let's get on to cruise ramirez so i don't have a mattel version yet but I'm planning on getting one. I'm only sure front. Nice face. That says Rusty's Racing Center 95, T95 actually. There are her review mirrors. They're plastic, so I'm gonna be careful not to break them. The rims. And her lighting plate reads, um, Tex Gas, that's a car pun, CO10CA, which is actually the person who voices as Cruz Ramirez in the movie, um, birthday, January 1st. And it also says something else. Uh. I think it says right there on the bottom, the lane car route. I don't know, I believe that's what it says. If it isn't, tell me in the comments below. I don't really get comments. I really need to be careful with these refute mirrors, because I don't want them to, like, break off. So let's get on to Sterling, who, um... He actually has, I believe so, metal review mirrors. <laughs> Here he is. So some people says that he's probably going to be a little bit of an antagonist in the movie. I wouldn't say like a villain, but somewhat like greedy or something. By the way, on the side it says Sterling. And here's his licensing plate. It says Sterling. Sir. Illinois. I meant Illinois. Illinois, I, I believe. Whatever. There's his face. And Illinois is actually where RC Cars 5 lives, as he said in this video. There's the base. Now let's go on to the rookie racers. Now I'll, re I'll review them both. So of course these two are just repaints and... They're just repaints of both Tim Treadless and Daniel Swerves. I can't pronounce Daniel's last name. But they're just repaints of them because they have the exact same face. Just spoke gray with orange and light blue detail. 
was sort of like the light blue when Mayor was, um, not rusty. So basically, they're exactly the same. Only with different colors and different spoilers. I love the spoilers. And these two both say Rusty Racing Center. Um, this guy is number three and this guy is 49. There's her back. It says 49 and 3 again. Here's the base. Not too different. So these guys are pretty nice. I haven't really seen them in a trailer so far. But, yeah. By the way, these guys aren't like normal metal. They're sort of like that, um... I don't know what type of metal it is, but it's sort of like the metal that they use for this Cars 1 McQueen on the base. And that Jeff Corvette right over there. Yeah. Sometimes I think, like with, um, I believe they're called grills right here. These stuff. I normally think that these grills on, like, Characters look like mustaches. What do you think? Well, I think they're clock grills on cars. Yeah. So I hope you enjoyed this review. Leave a comment below if you like it. If you don't, I'm okay. I'm kind of used to it. I've been on YouTube for almost two years, actually. Two more months. Two years on YouTube. But bam. So yeah, and also at the Disney store, I did see some art cars. I mean, I did see Mag, Miss Fritter, a Mag Hauler. I saw those mini cars and remote control. I don't know if there was like um, what was it? a demolition derby um five pack, you know, with Chester with with filter and T Bone and Taco. I don't know if they had that there, but. That's where I live. And of course, if you haven't seen my previous videos, I said that I live in New Jersey, but I'm not telling you what area I live in New Jersey. Okay, I'll tell you. It is too bad!